What's up, guys? This is T.224 NYC from the Stream Kings. Um, just wanted to do a quick video tutorial on this new uh, titanium build that I've been loving. Um, this this build, for me, it's been my daily driver for, I guess, probably about about a good month now. Um, it's, it looks really well, uh, but the main thing that I like on the inside is that uh, everything works. It works as it should. Not a lot of hiccups. Um, no delays, no lag, uh, and this build here is definitely fire stick friendly. A lot of YouTubers, they would do the review first and then do the install. Um, I'm a little bit backwards, so I'm going to show you guys how to install it, and then we'll do a quick review on the actual build. So in order to install it, you're going to want to install it on a fresh version of Kodi. And you're going to want to go into File Manager, Add Source, Oops. sorry, Add Source, and the link here is http colon forward slash forward slash repo dot daily updates dot tv let's see if this thing allows me to just cut and paste so this http colon forward slash forward slash repo dot daily updates dot tv let's see if it allows me just to paste it in so this way I can type it awesome so once you get that in go ahead and hit okay and we're going to give it a name we'll call it dot tv and then go ahead and hit okay And go ahead and hit the back button. Hit the back button again. Then click add-ons. Then click this little box right here. You're going to select the option to install from zip. .tv, which we chose. And what we're going to be installing is the repository InfraDroid 1.0.2 zip. And any moment now, we should get a pop-up saying InfraDroid Boxes has been enabled. Uh, immediately from there, you can just click Install from Repository. And then you're going to select InfraDroid Boxes. Then go into Program Add-ons. And we're going to install the Supreme Bills Wizard. And we're going to install that here. And it's going to download. And it should have a check mark, and then this may pop up. Uh, just go ahead and dismiss. And this allows you to save your favorites, save your repositories, any advanced XML settings, um, etc. I'm just going to hit continue. And we can ignore this. Then we're going to go ahead and click on the Supreme Wizard build, and we're going to go ahead and select the option to open it. This doesn't look right. Okay, there we go. So once you, you get to this screen, go ahead and select the option for Supreme Bills. You're going to select the Bills menu. And of course, we have Crypto, uh, Cody 17 Krypton. So we're going to select the Titan Krypton version 1.2. And since I already have a fresh install of Kodi, I'm just going to select the standard installation. We're going to select the option for yes to install. And this will quickly download. And what I'm going to do is while this is downloading, I'm going to go ahead and pause the video. Uh, let this download and I'll be right back with you. All right, guys, so we're back. Uh, we're just about done with the extraction process. For some reason, I don't know what's going on. I don't know if any of you guys have been having issues with Cody 17. 
Um, it just seems like the extraction process is a little bit slower. I've noticed that on my NVIDIA Shield, um, some of the fire sticks I use, and even on this computer. Uh, believe it or not, this PC is an i7 processor. Um, so something as simple as this 484 megabyte file should be extracted fairly quickly. Um, it's kind of hit or miss in my experience. Um, sometimes it's blazing fast and some of the other times it's really, really slow. This process probably took about a good 10 minutes or so just to download and to, um, to extract. The, this wizard, I don't know if they have some issues. It is fairly new. Um, so maybe their server isn't as fast as some of the others out there, like Ares and and some of the other more popular ones out there. But I assume with this build, the, it is going to gain some more popularity. And um, the developers are probably going to have to uh, beef up some of the servers just so the users can have a better experience overall just installing the process. Installing the uh, the build. But it looks like we're just about done. Uh, once it's all done extracting, you'll get the option of, it says, uh, would you like to force close Cody or reload the profile? In my experience, I don't know what reload profile means, so I leave that alone. I just go ahead and shut Cody down. I select the option to for force close. Uh, Cody shuts down. And then we're just going to go ahead and relaunch it here. And we got a nice little boot, boot animation. And then it automatically loads into Titanium. And this one is pretty cool because once you download it, I believe that the developers, they update all of the add-ons for you. Um, sometimes I know that uh, people install their builds and then all the add-ons start updating like crazy. Um, but this build, believe it or not, all of the builds by this uh, in this wizard, and we're going to go through all of them. Um, I'll be pushing out a bunch of videos to all of the builds uh, that, that are in the wizard. But um, this one is really nice because not a lot of add-ons will update because it's updated daily, believe it or not. So if you installed like some of the other uh, bills, you'll notice that it goes through this huge update. It'll start updating anything like 20, 30 bills. But sometimes when you install this, you might get one, two, maybe three updates. Looks like we got a lot of updates going on. So that was about six so far. But I think it's actually done. But it looks really good. Um, you have these up top uh, for your TV shows. These are going to be the most popular TV shows. You have your live sports. Uh, it looks like we have Bulldog Streams, Champion Sports, DC Sports. Uh, we have live hockey. Uh, some other live sports stream that I've never heard of. We got Maverick. Pro Sport, my favorite. Sports Devil. And the list just goes on and on. Um, all of these streams below... Uh, we have sports replays. A lot of this content is coming from Project D. Another, another solid add-on. And you have your live TV. You have the kids, kid zone uh, for you Spanish speakers. Uh, we have um, one section that's dedicated to you all. 
uh, Bob, an, another upcoming, up and coming developer who's been putting out some pretty solid contact as, con content as well. Uh, Phoenix, we have Evolve, UK Turk. We have a maintenance section, which is really nice. Um, so, for example, let's say you own a Fire Stick, NVIDIA Shield, or another Android box. You can just hop in here. Let me. If you come into your advanced settings, it'll ask you, you know, what are you running? Um, are you running Jarvis or Krypton? Of course, we're running Krypton. So we'll select the option for Krypton. It'll ask you, um, do you want the zero cash option? Uh, do you have a device with 500 megabytes of RAM or less, one gig of RAM or more? Um, if you have a Fire Stick, Amazon Fire TV Stick, or NVIDIA Shield. So I thought that was pretty cool. So it's a one-click install and go to address any buffering issues that you may have with your internet connection. So yeah, that's it. Um, if you guys like the build, uh, go ahead and smack the thumbs up. I'll go ahead and put a link in the description uh, for the uh, for the wizard here, uh, so you guys can can go ahead and install this if you like it. Um, next up, we'll be doing. Um, some reviews on some of the other bills that they have available. Um, and that's pretty much it. Again, this is T.224NYC from Stream Kings. Hope you guys have a good day. Thanks for watching. And uh, go ahead and subscribe if you like the video. Thanks, guys. Have a good night.